winter in the desert. It's been getting a lot of rain. Not a lot of rain, but it's been getting enough rain to green things up. I'm on my way to the RTR area. It is day five. Thought I'd take in a seminar and see what's going on. Give it a second chance. And visit with some people that are up here. That I know are up here. And uh, get back with you when I get there. These saguaros cactus are pretty incredible. This one's about... Oh, 15 feet maybe. This one over here. Take a closer look. This one looks like it's been damaged. That one's 15 feet or more tall. But it is interesting these tubes. Tubes in the cactus are what bring water to and from. Anyway, we'll continue on. This is the temporary parking area. And the stage area is down there where they do the seminars. So it is very well organized. And even the fire department's out here making sure that all the fire lanes are open and everything's okay. So I'm at uh, today's seminar with Bob Wells. He just spoke on, uh, got a show of hands how many people would be willing to pay five or ten dollars to come here to help pay for things. So I'm not sure what the seminar is supposed to be on, but I'm going to go see if I can find a schedule. So Bob is speaking on the fact that he's going to pass his legacy on to Homes on Wheels Alliance and they're going to, they're a nonprofit that will take care of this from now on, I guess. So I'm trying to be respectful and stay away and not get in people's faces. I don't want anyone to feel that. If you've heard of Burning Man, this is the burning van. You can sign it, and then they burn it. So I signed it. Right here. Land, and then at two is stealth parking. So we're covering both sides. At 4 p.m., prospecting class with Mike, which is at the very far end of this road, straight across. Go, Just go to the end, and you'll run into Mike. Huge, elaborate camp. You'll have a lot of prospecting gear set out. You will prospect. <laughs> and there's no one in the YouTube that they love to hate more than you, and I'll just tell you that they are all wrong. All Everything, every negative thing you've ever read about Carolyn is a lie by just really sad, pathetic people. Can you imagine how horrible their, uh, someone's life is? That the only thing you have in your in, in your life is to wake up and attack a really nice person. That, you know, I, I... All right, thank you all so much for being here. Uh, it has been a pleasure meeting so many of you. Um, who's ready to go boondocking? 